It's Kate Boyd from kateboydcheerleading.com again, and I'm back answering more questions. Um, one thing that I see common um, as far as people either finding my site, um, searching in Google, or um, or even just questions that I get is how to find good cheerleading music. Sorry, how to find good music for um, cheer music mixes, and so I thought that I would give you an inside peek into a couple of the places that I search for cheerleading music for my teams or um, for choreography, whatever it is that I need to be inspired. So first, you can always ask your team. Um, they're going to have some fun ideas. They have tons of songs that they're listening to all the time. Um, so find what is popular by asking your team ask for their suggestions. Certainly you won't be able to use all of them. You might not even be able to use any of them if you have a very strict um, music policy at your school or competition company, but there is a possibility that you'll be able to use some of them and they'll appreciate you giving them an opportunity to uh, feed into what you're doing. Another place that I look, um, and this is like Probably the number one place that I look is iTunes. I just go to the top 100, 150 songs and, um, you know, just hit the sample and listen. And I'm like, oh, that has a good beat. That could be. D and I'll think of whatever the music makes me think of routine wise. Um, I'm like, oh, I can see a stunt going at that part in the music or, oh, that's got nice ripply noises for jumps or stuff like that. You'll start to pick up on it. Um, and even some songs that are slower, but have sort of, I mean, their beat is slower, but their music sounds a little bit like it picks up and it builds or it's got an up, um, I don't know, it's it's hard to describe, but iTunes is like number two. Um, go through there, just listen to some samples, you certainly won't be able to use all of them, um, you know, cleanliness and things like that, but it's a good place to start. Okay, next thing I can do if you are looking for especially a particular theme um, for like pep rally music or something, one thing I do is I search keywords either in iTunes or in Google. So say um, it's we had like a military themed pep rally. So I searched for stuff like war or army or um, fighter, stuff like that that might sort of be able to build in that's sort of within the theme or America, like stuff like that. So type in keywords and you'll come up with um, songs or albums with those things. And there's a lot of bad stuff, but there's a couple of good things too. So you definitely have to do more combing that way, but it's good. You can also Google because somebody may have put together lists like that, which would be good. Okay, so the very last place... Um, not last in importance, but last that I'm going to list today, is um, actually on my website. What I do um, several times a year is put out the top 10 songs right now that I am that I like for cheer, for cheer music. And um, that's I think it's a great resource. However, 10 songs is not a lot, and then you end up with some that you, you may not be able to use because... Um, your squad needs something that's like super clean and coming from coaching in Christian schools. I totally understand that. And you also need stuff for your youth teams. Um, you know, they shouldn't necessarily be dancing to like dirty hip hop songs. So, um, what I'm also doing is putting together, um, a list that you can pay for that will be broken down in several different categories. So there will be songs for stunts, songs for dances, songs for tumbling, and songs for jumps, as well as songs for young people, and songs for um, clean songs, and a few different themes, uh, three or four different themes, and um, throwback songs. So songs that are, sorry, more, I guess your girls would consider them oldies, but you know, they're just like the songs I grew up with, um, and even some actual oldies. So um, they'll be full of stuff like that. Um, because it takes so long to categorize, it's one thing just to say, here's top 10 songs that I like, but because I'm taking a lot of time to categorize, um, and I've mixed music before, so I've got uh, 
I think I've got pretty good musicality and it's really fun for me. Um, so anyway, because it's going to be this huge list at the end of the year, I am charging for it. But I think it will be worth every penny to not have to search the depths of the internet or go through iTunes and search for yourself. I'm going to do hours of iTunes searching for you. You don't even have to worry about it. I'm going to go through and make sure that there's no dirty words or innuendos in songs. Like, that'll be my job, not yours. So everything will be cleared for you. You'll have... Um, Plenty of songs to choose from from whatever level your team is. So I highly encourage you to check that out. I will have the link down below in um, the description. So be sure to check that out. So those are my four places. Ask your team, search iTunes, Google and iTunes search um, keywords, and definitely check out my list. If you liked this post, then please subscribe to my channel. And also go check out kateboycheerleading.com for more great tips like this and don't forget to click the link below to get on the list and get access to my favorite songs for the whole year.